This is Playmo Bello and this is the set 70752 from the year 2021. Skeleton Army the from Novomor Violet Vale from the Saha Ahari Sands. These are pretty much mystery packs, but they are heavy and they are large. And they are basically some sort of cup, skeleton cup that has a lot of little pieces inside, including a character. The top you have a cool reflective sticker that you can remove and put anywhere else you want. I try to look through a light using a light, you know, a light source from behind and you cannot see what character you have inside. I really tried for a while. Reason is possibly why they give you the sands in there. That sand is in there to confuse the eye through a light source. The only other option is going to be this number here. I'm gonna show the numbers and we will see if we get repeats. There are tapes on both sides. All right, let's see. A lot of sand in there. Look at that, that's so much sand. That's a lot of sand. Guess I'll pour everything out here. Wow, there is so much sand. This is amazing how much sand you get. That's, that's really cool. I never seen such a thing. If you don't want to get spoiled, don't look right now. I'm going to show all the options that you can find. This is what we got. We got this guy here. He has a bunch of cool looking accessories, including a bow and arrow and a snake that he can actually hold with his hands. Bow, a quiver and a cool looking blade. And this guy looks really, really cool. I didn't think they were going to be this cool. And he has a helmet that I'm pretty sure fits on any Playmobil head. Okay, let's go for the next one. The next one. And here we go. So this is the guy we got. The helmet looks just like it. The neck scarf is different. Look at that. Very different. He got two awesome swords and a scorpion. Here is our next one. Those are the numbers. Still says 01. I think 01 is for series 1. Maybe the other numbers are what's supposed to be important. Fuck. Repeat number 1. I just learned that their legs. Look at that. You can go backwards with it or forwards. It's a very different kind of Playmobil. And the hands do turn. Look how much sand I have already. Just three little buckets. Here is the number of the next one. Here we go. Look at this golden Skeletor. He has some some drawings here on the legs and on his face. And then there is this, this uh, mummy encasement that you can put him in there and he can come to life or so he also has a helmet a green fire and a cool looking staff endless amounts of sand here's another one we'll see what that gives us let's see here we get another different version of the skeletors this one is actually my favorite so far because he has a sword and a shield. And these guys are reminding me of the Army of the Dead from Lord of the Rings, The Return of the King. This is really awesome. I really hope Playmobil launches a Lord of the Rings series. That would be absolutely fantastic. Number six, that's the numbers he has on it. Another different one, fantastic. Looks like a shackle. This guy is absolutely awesome. He has a shako, a wooden shako, some cool bandana on his head, a jacket, and a chain. If you see here, it's the same color of the sand, so it might be difficult. A chain with a chain ball, but the chain ball is not just a ball, it's a skull. Number seven. And it's a repeat. So the one we got was this warrior here, which is my second warrior. So I have two warriors with shields. Here's the next one.
A different one, yes. Another different one. This one is has my favorite tone of bones. It looks more realistic because he's kind of dark gray. He has a necklace, a cool helmet, a piece of goo that looks like it came from Ghostbusters, a shield that's pretty much the same shield as this guy here, and a strange looking axe. It looks like some sort of ghostly wood or ghostly metal, green ghostly metal. Here we have All right, we got a third Cape Crusader here with a sword. Tent mystery pack that will be opened. Ooh, a very different one. Here's what we got, this guy here in the front. He has a torch with green fire, a cool looking hat. It's a skull hat with a horn, a red horn on it, and a piece of goo. He also has a squarish uh, Roman armor on his shoulders and bracelets. Are the numbers of the second to last? All right, we got second to last here. Let's see what we get. Yes, it's a repeat. I got a repeat. It's once again the guy with the torch. I also got an extra bracelet for him. So now he has two on one side. This is the hat doesn't stay in his head much. This one is a little better, but this one is just loose on there. Okay, I just uh, realized that the torch man has a awesome sight, a weapon, a short-handed weapon. I missed it because he fell on the sand and I didn't see it because it's the same color as the sand. Here is our last mystery pack. Hopefully it's a different one. All the sand. Another repeat, it's the Bowman, so now I have two Bowman in this army. Which this is probably the only Playmobil mystery series that I don't think anyone is going to be upset for getting repeats. I do want to complete the set, yes, but the more the merry. $9 price, it's around $9 for this uh, $9.99 I believe for each one of these little tubes. The price is high, but I think for the experience you get, for having all of these sands to play with and this the quality of each one of these skeletors i think it's worth it and considering the fact that you can't feel the package this time so you can't tell what you're getting i'll just go to ebay and buy different kinds so i wouldn't have to waste too much money but with this series i think it's worth it they are really cool they're awesome looking and uh, for someone who's a fan of Lord of the Rings, this is really, really nice. This guy here, one of my favorites, a fully golden Skeletor. These were my least favorite until I saw they actually had a weapon. I thought they didn't have a weapon. I thought it was just this. So they are really cool because they have that melee weapon. And then, of course, the guys with the swords and shields are really awesome. Cannot wait to get the remaining of the collection. We're missing this guy with a round shield, we're missing this guy with a mace, this guy with a net, this guy with an axe, and this guy with a flag. This looks like coins, doesn't it? Looks a lot like coins, so why not have Uncle Scrooge dive in his money bin with his coins? If you're old enough, you've seen DuckTales, and that's just cool. This is a hint for Playmobil to launch DuckTales as Playmobil series. Come on. And here is all the skeletons. The ones in the back are repeats. The ones right here in the front are not repeats. We have the main guy, which is I think a mage or some sort of warlock. Then there's this guy with the melee and the torch. This guy with the sword and shield. This guy with the snake and bow. This one has the shackles, we have this one with two swords, and this guy with a eteral axe. If you buy 12 surprise boxes, you get an average of 7 different kinds and then just 5 that are repeats.